But now to a family's heartache, as their first home is literally being eaten away by termites. And what makes matters even worse, a report carried out by a qualified pest inspector gave their house the all clear. Now they face financial ruin. All last year, the Polizzi's worked their guts out to save for this modest home on Brisbane's north side. They paid $130,000, ecstatic their building and pest inspector had given it the all clear. I feel like we've been con. Ludovic realised they had been sold a lemon when he noticed telltale termite tracks in the laundry. I was just appalled. I was, I was shocked. I had, my first thoughts were, you know, how bad is the damage to the rest of the house? Panicked, the couple called in two experts, Roger Karash, an architect and builder from Brisbane's Arcade Centre, and Grant Curry, managing director of the company, The White Ant Man. It didn't take long for both to agree the Polizzi's were being eaten out of house and home. To me, it's, um, it's, it's negligence on the part of the, uh, the inspector that's gone through this. There's been a, quite an amount of activity, and, and that activity should have been picked up. <laughs> Everywhere they looked, they found signs of the unwelcome guests, major damage and live activity both outside and in. There's termites active in here and they've eaten out the framing. This floorboard has been extensively damaged here. It's the kind of news that can break a homeowner's heart. Sick. Basically sick. Because I know that we won't be able to get the money at all to fix it. I just believe that they just were hoping for us not to realise for six months and you know, that way they could just wash their hands of it. The original report was done by David Black from Brisbane Health Inspection. He's a licensed plumber, builder and pest inspector. He did record evidence of damage but in one area only, the back fence. He then went on to note the house had no evidence of activity, therefore termite treatment was not essential. I would say that he's, he's incompetent and shouldn't be doing the work. Detailed subsequent inspections tell a very different story to Black's report. Yes, there are termites, yes, there is extensive damage, and yes, treatment is essential and is needed urgently. He's just not done his job properly. It would appear to be that. That's the case. The couple had wanted to use downstairs as a playroom for their two children, Taylor and Bailey but they've now been told the large area needs to be bulldozed and rebuilt. The cost will literally break them. It could be up to 50000 That's unbelievable. Right. We don't have that kind of money. We don't even know where to get it from. No. $15,000 to treat the termites, 25000 in reconstruction costs, and 10000 for a thorough inspection, wall by wall. And when you see this stuff, I mean, look at it, it just, it just crumbles. How do you describe the level of confidence of oh, this inspector? He's just, these are shocking. These, I, don't, I don't see how this bloke should be registered or even have a license to do this kind of work. It's just, um, it's sickening. David Black operates his business from home. We knocked on the door, but a house sitter said he was overseas. So how are they in New Zealand? Ludovic is now demanding answers from agents Rain and Horn at Calanga in Brisbane who sold him the property a month ago. Cameron Maddox Please. is the real estate agent's principal. I'd have second thoughts about recommending this bloke to anybody else. Well, if, if yeah. you know, I mean, if it turns out the way that it appears that it is turning out, yeah. then I will have very, very much have second thoughts about it as well. It was Rain and Horn who recommended the inspector, but insist they also passed on the names of others. Well, how do you feel about his work now? I have to be concerned about it, obviously. The Polizzi's only hope now to fix this kind of termite damage is that the pest inspector is covered by insurance and they can make a claim. In the meantime, the house they fell in love with, they now hate with a passion. Boy, everywhere I look now, if I look at a wall, I think... What's behind, what's behind it? It's indescribable. And I never, ever, ever wish this upon any other person. Look at that. For some time now, a current affair has been covering the shocking record of some pest control companies in Queensland and inspectors who have failed to do an adequate job, all too often leaving a trail of innocent homeowners stranded. I couldn't believe I had a very sick feeling in my stomach going, you know, how could this happen? Pretty disturbing, to be honest. I was numb. 
and I think I was probably paralysed from doing anything for a couple of weeks. Well, this was your dream home. Do you feel that your dream has been shattered? Yeah, we certainly do. Um, you know, we've done a lot of planning to purchase our first home and, um, you know, save a lot of money up. And then within three weeks, our dream's been shattered. Lexi Hamilton Smith reporting there. And an industry...